What's up? I'm Drew Downs. I'm a 2024. I go to Green Level High School. I play outfield. I play for the South Charlotte Panthers. I'm committed to Vanderbilt University, and this is a day in the life. So I probably got into baseball around three or four. I can't remember a time where I wasn't even just hitting like a wiffle ball inside our house or anything. And then what, why I got into it was because of my dad. He played in high school and wanted to go further than that, but never got to. So he introduced me to it and I just fell in love with it. So I picked Vanderbilt over every other college because just the coaches were a huge reason for it. Coach Corbin, just his knowledge of the game and the fact that he basically built that program. I just love the coaching staff a lot. Coach Baxter, the way he does hitting, I agree with pretty much everything he says. And I think that I'll take my game to the next level playing under that coaching staff. I got in contact with Vanderbilt by, they sent me an email from Coach Baxter actually, is one of the, most people think they're spam emails, but I filled out the questionnaire and my high school coach actually called me that night and said that Coach Baxter wanted to talk to me. So I talked to him and that was a week before I played in Jupiter. So I talked to him a lot, we talked probably two times in two weeks and then he came to watch me play in Jupiter because we were facing another Vanderbilt pitching commit so he came to that game basically to watch me face off against that kid who was really good obviously so that's how it went and then from there he watched me for that tournament we talked probably five other times after that and then got the offer on a zoom and committed on the zoom about probably three, four days later. Since I'm committed to D1, playing for high school, I mean, I go to a new high school, I just moved, this is our first year with seniors. We don't really have that much to lose. We have the world to gain because we haven't been around long enough. So I don't really feel pressure by it. And that was one of the main things Coach Corbin and Coach Baxter told me was, don't try to live up to being committed to Vanderbilt. Just keep playing your game because you got the offer and you committed based on how you played your game. So just keep doing like how I was doing it. Don't try to change anything just because who I'm going to in college. Uh, my greatest strength for sure is my hitting. I, I'm like a 
for travel, I'm a two hole hitter and I see myself as two, three holes, somewhere around there. A lot of base hits, a lot of, I don't strike out very much, but weakness is definitely running. I need to get a lot. My favorite player of all time is Ken Griffey Jr. And I like him just because of how smooth his swing was and like how many home runs he hit and just how his swing looks. I just, I've always loved him. And then I love Mike Trout a lot too, just because of how he, he doesn't get wrapped up in all the like internet drama type stuff. He's just, and he's really good too. He's probably, in my opinion, the greatest of all time. And then other than that, uh, I like Chris, Chris Bryant a lot too, just cause I'm originally from Illinois. So I'm a big Cubs fan and 2016 when they won, I kind of developed a liking for Chris Bryant just cause he was a big part of that, so. Uh, my favorite baseball memory is for sure going to Cooperstown. I didn't get to go with my 12U team, but I went with another 12U team to guest play and just the whole experience was amazing. It, like the old jerseys and everything, it was just awesome. So 
to get noticed by colleges, you just gotta play your game. Don't worry about who's in the stands, just play you. If you see a coach in the stands, you're still gonna go out and play baseball at the end of the day. They don't wanna see a kid that's all tense when they play. They wanna see someone that's relaxed and gets the job done. So just don't play for who's in the stands and play for yourself, just play how you play. We started off the day at red line. I hit off the tee with my wood bat and my metal bat for probably around 30, 45 minutes. And then we came out to green level high school and I hit front toss on the field with both my metal and wood bats. And then after that, I hit BP on the field with both the bats again. And then I did some outfield work after that, fly balls, ground balls and throwing. And that was a day in the life.